true life, I have no control over what my hair does. Like, what are you? Thanks. Hey everyone, so today I wanted to film a haul because I go to Hawaii in a week and it's kind of insane to think that I'm leaving for Hawaii in a week for a full week. Um, I'm just really excited to go on vacation. I haven't been on vacation in a very long time, so this is going to be really fun. And I realized today, which is my day off, um, that I don't have clothes for this vacation and I leave in four days. So I went to the mall and went shopping because I literally have nothing to wear to Hawaii where it's gonna be warm. So let's just get into the haul. And I'm gonna show you a bunch of like bathing suits and stuff that I got like three months ago um, in preparation for this vacation that I don't think I ever showed you guys. So let's just get into it. Starting off with American Eagle, I just got this tank top, which is super cute. It's like a baby doll style tank top, but the cool thing is that it's got all this strap detail. Um, like the bras that are really popular now but that I can't wear because I have boobs and it just they don't make them in my size so this is the next best alternative um, but yeah I just think it's super cute and comfortable and won't make me sweat my butt off in Hawaii. Then I went to Target and just got some of these super comfortable they're almost like PJ pants the super flowy um, loose wide leg um, pants uh, with pockets I got them in two different colors, this really cool green like Aztec print and then another pair that's just black and gray that has um, vertical uh, stripes with Aztec print as well. These were super cheap and I figure, I figure they're just easy to throw on um, if it's not like super cold. What? If it's not super hot, hello. Then something super random that I didn't actually buy specifically for Hawaii, but I'm definitely bringing to Hawaii with me to wear is my new hat. This is from Freedom Industries. It says F-bomb, which if you know me, it's my favorite word. I don't know what to say. Sorry, not sorry, but I think this hat is awesome. It's camo, uh, it's a trucker style hat, and then it just has a bomb with an F on it. Then I went to Macy's and I literally have zero shorts. I think I have one pair that I can wear that I can like bring, um, but I don't, I just don't wear shorts. It's, I don't like them. So I got a pair of shorts because I figure I can't wear jeans, um, even though these are denim shorts, but they're Miss Me. Um, they're not super short or anything. They have cute embellishments on the pockets um, and then on the side as well, Aztec print. They were on sale for $34. Um, marked it down from the original price of around almost a hundred uh, so I thought that was a really good deal and they fit pretty well so yay then also for Macy's I got this dress it's like a high neck um, this super popular high neck style dress um, with this crazy print on it and it's tight on the top and then a skater skirt on the bottom um, it's probably goes to my knees this was also on sale for um, it was on sale for I think like $13 and the original price is $70 so good deal. So the first thing I got is this super cute top. It's white with this light blue like paisley print on it. It's off, it has straps like normal things top straps and then it's off the shoulder with li little short sleeves and then the back has this lace up detail. Um, I think it's super cute, it's extremely lightweight and very comfortable, um, perfect for hot weather and it was on sale for $15 so I think that's a really freaking good deal and the quality isn't that horrible for how cheap it is. And the last thing I got from Charlotte Russe is this dress which I think is freaking adorable and super comfortable. It's striped blue, um, blue and white striped, like a dark navy, with this lace um, cutout in the center that goes all the way around, right under the boobs, and it flares out to an A-line. Again, this probably goes just like a little bit above my knee, but it's, again, super comfortable, lightweight, and then it has crisscross straps in the back that you totally can't tell that it has, but yeah. And this was also $15, so super good deal. And again, the quality is actually pretty good. It's like a um, knockoff neoprene. Moving on to bathing suits. First one is this flamingo top that just has the ruffle. It's from Victoria's Secret Pink, super cute. And then these super cute orange pair, they're like a, um, I don't even know, creamsicle color with the rouging on the butt. Um, Again, I've never worn either pair of these. Uh, I've had them for probably two years, and I think I got both of these on sale for super cheap, so, but yeah, cute. Then a couple months back, I went to Free People, and I got this black lace uh, cover-up for my swimsuits. 
um, when I'm in Hawaii. It's a super deep v-neck, but again, it's just like a cover-up. Um, and it's pretty short. It's just black, super basic. Um, it's just a good cover-up, so I spent 50 bucks on it, which is kind of a lot, but it is free people. And the original price was $168, so yeah, I think 50 is a pretty good deal. <laughs> I bought a lot of bathing suits. So I'm gonna go through these really fast. So I have this one that has the triangle V thing in the middle and then a paisley print and it's strapless, but it has a strap that can go around your neck. This one that again is strapless, but has a strap that you can put around your neck that has this super cute bow um, detail on the front. I love this. I just figured these strapless ones are good for tanning, not good for anything else because my boobs will fall out. Then I got this super basic paisley blue colored, just normal normal triangle bikini. <laughs> Super basic black bottoms with the um, rouging detail along the edges and then it also has like rouging down the butt so they're a little bit cheeky. Same exact pair in white. These were all on like super clearance from um, Tilly's, Paxan, stuff like that. They were like five bucks each. Super, super good deal. And then the last bikini top that I have is this black crochet um, with this colorful um, ties on it. I think this is really cute. Um, it's a little small, but hey, it's for tanning, right? The last bathing suit is actually a one piece and it says Murica on it, which I think is so cool and it has a super deep scoop back. Um, but yeah, I think it's cute. It'll be good for, um, I, I think we're gonna go surfing, so it'll be good for surfing, but yeah, I think it's, it's me in a shirt. Can you tell I love everything Americana? So that is everything for this haul. I hope you guys enjoyed watching it and are excited to see a bunch of footage from me in Hawaii. I'm going to be taking my boyfriend's GoPro and filming a bunch of stuff while I'm there, so stay tuned for that. Um, also, I swear I have a DIY coming up soon. Um, it's just super time consuming to film and edit, so I'm trying to finish that and I will have that up as soon as possible, so subscribe if you're excited for that. Um, and I think that's it. So, oh, I also got eyelash extensions recently, um, if you guys can tell. And I kind of have a crazy like story behind them, so if you guys want to hear that, let me know in the comments below, because it was kind of an insane experience, and I don't know. I don't know if anybody would be interested in hearing about it. So that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you all in my next one. Bye!